I see the people walking behind me. That's the Vietnam Memorial back in there. Uh, it, I'm near the Lincoln Memorial. Over this way, uh, you see, oh, there's the building. See, the, that's the Lincoln Memorial. And then you could go over to the Vietnam Memorial. And I'm facing the new uh, Korean War Memorial. <laughs> and then on the other end of this block is the World War II Memorial. So we got Abraham Lincoln. I guess he represents the Confederate War. <laughs> and three other wars here, memorials. See, we have memorials to war warriors. What about people who made peace? <laughs> Nobody has a peace department. <laughs> Actually, there is a building across the street over here uh, with the word peace in it. And I'm not sure what it is. I think it's a, sort of like a quasi-government or non-profit or, or something like that. I don't know. But what I want to talk about is now we have three different grants. Okay, you know, maybe if you know my work or what we've been doing for a year or two now is giving out, we're up to like $60,000 a year in grant money to members of Let's Go Help, you have to be a member because they're the people who created the money, so they should get it back. So when we make profits, and we have been, um, uh, we give the money back and grants to individuals, and it's a very simple application. You just tell us why you need and what you would do with a $1,000. So a couple sentences is enough. Some people, I think we have a limit of 300 words, but... Yeah, you know, usually a few sentences would be all easy to do it. So now we have two others. Uh, and the $60,000 is the deadline is on the 4th of the month. So the next one will be uh, April 4th. Now we have two other uh, grants. One is we started a small one for car repair. There's a lot of people who, you know, just can't, you know, car repairs is stopping their life. Yeah, so we're giving $500 to 10 members for help with car repairs. Now, you could apply to both, but you can't win one both. <laughs> uh, that's, I'm pretty sure, what these guys We do this in a group, so I think that's what we uh, came up with. And, and then we give out free computers, 20 every month. And that's very important. It's very important for you to do job searching. It's very important for you to do uh, searching for grants or money and, and help and things like that you really have to have more than a phone i mean people do do it on the phone uh and some people i, mean, I know members she told me yeah she's got yeah, 20 30 thousand dollars that's doing it all on the phone well uh what we do is we show you how to find a free one and if you can't find a free one then you could apply for our uh and we do that every month we send you a brand new uh uh, a, a laptop from, I mean, it's not a big expensive thing, but it, it's new and does the job. Uh, and that's important that you have that. Uh, looking good. <laughs> Hiya, Katie. Uh, are you the tool I know in Maryland or are you another? Because I've seen the word name around. Uh, it, oh, it's getting cold now. So, you know, as soon as that sun goes down, us old people get a little chilly. <laughs> <laughs> and that, that that's that's a problem. Boy, and that's why I guess so many old people move to Florida. The blood gets thinner. <laughs> but so you have three grants. You know, the sixty thousand uh, dollars, then you can apply for the one that's on the twentieth of the month. So one is on the fourth, one is on the twentieth, and the uh, free laptops is on the thirtieth. No, I'm one with the purple hair. Oh yes. Thank you, purple. Yes, I want some. <laughs> please, <laughs> please, please, please. Uh, and so that's the three to do away. Yeah, I don't know if you saw the video I did yesterday or the day before, I think, about Pepsi Cola and uh, LeBron James have a grant giveaway. This is how much they're giving away. They have this big multi billion dollar campaign because Pepsi now has water or something. I don't know, some new product. So for entrepreneurs, they're giving four grants of $25,000 apiece. Wow! <laughs> four grants, $100,000. Man, uh, they do spent more than $100,000 doing the ad <laughs> for the campaign than what they're giving away for. It just, I mean, I, I just see businesses that are so 
hypocritical in my mind. But, you know, that's a biased opinion. I'm sure they're not all that way, too. Uh, but that, that's, I think what I'm really doing is bragging how much we're giving because I can't believe we're giving I can't believe it. I'd have a business that would give away like a half a million dollars a year or more. I mean, uh, <laughs> I don't know I could make that, let alone give it away. Uh, so that's what we do. Most of the, uh, the profit is really given to individuals you know, who are members because uh, most of our members are hurting financially. That's why they join. So it's if we're making money off of them, I think that you know, they should be the recipients, not us. I mean, we got to pay us first so we can keep the, the lights on <laughs> and, and, and providing the help that people need. And then after that, it, it, it's, it's given to people. Uh, and that's what it's all about. Sorry, that should have said that your blood thinner. <laughs> I am in Florida. Oh, good. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, and. Life is fun. I never thought 80 would be this fun. I never thought 70 would be that fun. Uh, it's really great. And that's what we want to do, too, with Let's Go Help, is show other people how they can keep doing things for the rest of life, contributing to life, uh, and starting things, and trying to solve little problems in their neighborhood or whatever, creating income so you don't have to rely on your retirement. And you just make money till you die. What the hell? <laughs> I mean, retirement... To me, it means you just had a boring job. <laughs> yeah, or, or get that training where you're getting a job that you really love to do. So, you know, most of the jobs, you know, you can do it, you know, 80, 90 years old. It, you know, it's not working in a factory. Like when we started the retirement system, that's what it was. And so, right, you know, I, I couldn't work in a factory as much now. I could barely walk anymore. <laughs> walk my six, seven miles a day it, it is enough. You know, lifting heavy stuff or whatever. Now that's gone. I even gave up riding bicycles. That was too dangerous. I had a motor scooter. That was too dangerous. Even running became dangerous because I would fall on my face. <laughs> uh, and the bones and muscles are fine. It was just the balance and the tripping and oh god, three, four days in a row, I'd fall flat on my nose and scar up my face. I said, well, those days are over. <laughs> so now, I know another thing I've been doing a lot of things with uh, is, uh, you know, training. And there is, there's so much job training going on now. We, we're trying to change this whole country into manufacturing. And it's not manufacturing like a It's the manufacturing of uh, electric cars, batteries. Uh, energy saving stuff and, and that takes uh, some skills you know and so that's why the government is paying you to get these skills to work because we have more people we have more jobs available than we have people looking for jobs and you believe in that yeah and so because people don't have the skills that they're that they need to fill those positions so now what the government does is pay for you to get the skills. There's even programs that pay you while you're learning the skills. So it depends. It's different in every city, county, whatever. Uh, <laughs> so you have to go out and find out what's in your area. Uh, and it's nonprofit organizations. It's government. It's not going to be Google. I mean, don't look for Google for that because it's, Google's going to find you people that want you to you know, they're going to talk you into paying them a lot of money, going into debt, getting government loans and everything to pay them to train you when you can get that for free. Let's see, the free people don't advertise in Google. The people who want money from you advertise in Google. So if you're going to hang around Google, you're going to find those people and not the other people. So please, when you're looking for help and you don't have much money, you don't you want to stay away from anything that's dot com. <laughs> and just go to dot gov g o v uh, or dot org o r g. Somebody said they need that type of help. Uh, well, that, there is so much help like that all over. Now the other thing too is that we're all spoiled. We want everything to be easy. We want to make one phone call, fill out one application, and get the money. 
it doesn't work that way. It does sometimes, but for you or me, it probably won't. And we're going to have to make a bunch of calls, try a bunch of places, fail, try again, <laughs> and keep at it to make something happen. That's true with everything, whether you're starting a business, getting a job, or whatever. But we're spoiled. And, and I think what it is is the marketing spoils us because we see all the ads. They tell you how easy it is to do this, as long as you give me $10,000, know, or whatever the hell it is. Yeah. And it's not. Even if you give them the $10,000, it's still not going to be easy. All you did was find them. <laughs> now you got to find the people to do the work that don't charge you $10,000. And that's out there. That's what I'm trying to do with Let's Go Help. It's really, I mean, I've written 100 books, had two New York Times bestsellers, a couple companies worth millions. And this has been the most rewarding and satisfying thing I've ever done in my life. And right now it's starting to freeze. <laughs> that wind is blowing. There's no sun up here. And I gotta go and stretch my muscles at the gym a little bit more. So I, I get keep those working. Oh man, it, it, it's uh it's a constant battle. And I think we weight, exercise, everything. I was a short, fat kid. I, I fight weight every day of my life. <laughs> There's instant Lesko inside waiting to come out. And he was out a long time ago. <coughs> but I started running in my mid-20s or so. <coughs> so I've been running for 40 years or more. Uh, 50 or 65. So if I 30, if I started, uh, yeah, that's 50 years of running. And I just quit a couple of days ago, or a couple of years ago, uh, and haven't hurt my bones or muscles or anything. <laughs> and the doctor, I remember back in the 70s, said, oh, you're lucky if you get 45 years. I mean, if you be, run until you're 45 or 50. Man, I ran in my late 70s. Yeah. So we're all guessing in life. You take anything as a grain of salt. Listen to your body more than anything else. Yeah. Okay, guys, I'm going to start pumping some <laughs> muscles so I warm up this body a little bit. See you soon. Don't forget, letsgohelp.com. Three different grants now. One for 60000 on the fourth of the month. 5000 for car repair on the uh, 20th of the month. <laughs> and then... 20 comp laptop computers on the 30th of the month. I can't wait to give them away. <laughs>